5. And again, I'm just going to give it a second here. And we see that all of our uh, ECT and IET, IET corrections are not going to be applying. That's because it's already warmed up here. We are not, um, the engine coolant temperature, temperature has not dropped down low enough that it's going to be adding any correction. So at this point, we should be out of any kind of post start. We can see our short term trim is already starting to make some adjustments here. So let's go in. I'm going to throw my headphones on. Let's do another pool, adding that spark timing in. Let's see if it made any difference um, and see if we can pick up the power at all and drop the boost on the top end. We can optimize everything. shut it down myself because I want to pull the spark plugs out and see what they look like. We've made several pulls now that we got the distributor fixed and the timing's all back in line and we've added some timing. And we walk in the timing in, we want to see what the timing is doing. So I purposely shut it down at the top end of the pool. I'm going to yank the spark plugs out. Let's look at the data first. Um, let's check out what this is going to be reading here. Jumping into our data log, let's kind of pan through. We can see the air fuel showing here 11.2, duty cycles uh, showing 77% still. Boost is going still to 18 pounds, 17 pounds, that's 17 and a half pounds there, it's okay. Looking at our ignition timing, it's going here 21 degrees, 20 degrees at around 18, 19 PSI. And let's take a look at our boost to make sure that that is consistent, so that's consistent. Um, that all looks good. Let's take a look at the dynograph and see if we gain any more power. So we can see here, we're actually at 590 and 344 torque. So the power really isn't doing anything. I added that spark timing in, it didn't, it didn't gain any. I'm gonna take it back out because we don't wanna add any more spark timing than we need to. We're also gonna be taking a look at the spark plugs here and hopefully they look clean still. Um, but this is gonna be part of the trial and error with tuning. You wanna walk the boost in and then add the spark timing in and make sure your fuel's all dialed in. And we 